Well, Donnie, it looks like I'm going to be fighting a little bit of uh, fog this morning. Yeah. Wow. It's really gotten, it's actually gotten more foggy since I pulled her out. Yeah, and until 11 a.m. is the warning, too. Yeah, I definitely agree. It's going to be slow to burn off today. Good morning, Ruby. Well, I don't think we have to worry about uh, seeing the sunrise too much this morning. Thankfully, it's not quite so thick that I can't see cars and things ahead of me. I um, generally run around with my front fog lights on because I like the extra brightness. Um, but I went and I turned on the rear fog lights this morning just in case. I'm not sure exactly what that does. I need to get out and look, <laughs> but not right now. Traffic is uh, moving along normally this morning. This fog is uh, mostly pretty to look at, but not impacting uh, driver's ability to see. It's 46 out there, and we're going to be in the 60s today. And even warmer tomorrow, I think we might hit 70. Uh, we're not going to see the sun for a few days, though. Not for any length of time, anyway. Yep, downtown is basically hid in the fog this morning. Thought I'd drive over to Fayetteville Street to see if the uh, Capital City Christmas tree was lit. And um, I'm disappointed to see that it's not and that there's a truck in front of it and there's some guys doing some stuff. Well, the tree over here in front of the Performing Arts Center is lit. I drove around um, downtown Raleigh for a bit and I was able to get one pretty cool photo over on Fayetteville Street where the snowflakes line all the poles and uh, someone was crossing the street. Interesting vanishing point and um, converted to black and white, which I normally don't like, but in this case I think it fits the mood of the image, so um, that was kind of exciting. I'm hanging out here this morning. Um, I have uh, something to do in town a little after 9, and uh, so I'm going to take photos, play Pokemon Go, listen to my book, um, drive around. You know, I thought about going shopping like over by the Supercharger or something, but um, I think not today. We'll see. Um, but yeah, I'll be hanging out for a little bit and getting back home a little later this morning. I'm back home and uh, I do have a couple hours now before I need to turn around and go get Johnny. Hey Tux! Mittens! Hi Mittens! <laughs> How are you buddy? Saying dry? It's 1.30 and I'm on my way back to Raleigh to get Johnny. And as I came down the driveway these deer crossed. I don't think I see any more to my left but I'm sort of stopped on the hill. <laughs> wanted to get their picture and uh, I'll start moving now <coughs> excuse me hi guys hello I count five yeah one two three four five often there are seven oh, let me just look around and make sure I don't see any more I just dropped Johnny off at Taekwondo. Um, we had another student in the car with us this afternoon, so I didn't do any filming on the way out of Raleigh. And um, 
we were just, you know, home for a short period of time before heading back out for Taekwondo on Mondays is early at 5 p.m. Don's out for his run. We haven't had any package deliveries today, but we're thinking the mailman uh, at least will be coming uh, shortly. And, uh, you know, it's uh, not raining and it's warm and Michelle could go shopping tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> Uh, that's about all that's going on here this afternoon. I got a picture of Ruby by the town Christmas tree. And then one block over near where we were parked for the parade. Is this uh, Star Wars theme decorated house? Looks great. A few extra miles today at 116.1. Ruby's currently uh, sitting at 99 miles of rated range. <laughs> 